This is DJ Lazy K, the mixtape queen, chilling out with Big Apple right here. I already know. See, I ain't got to say know. nothing. You don't have to say nothing. <laughs> I want to take over this interview right here. I'm going to ask him questions. He looks like that. he know a lot. You already know who it is. Your boy Big Apple IMC represent Checkmate New York and Mo Flavor TV. We are doing it live for the all female. Yes. Oh, all ladies. All ladies. Yeah, all ladies. All yeah. ladies. Yeah. 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 Not all ladies. ladies. All the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I'm with the, the beautiful, the talented, the lovely, the chicka chicka chicka. DJ Lazy K. In the place to be. The Harlem, place. you already know. Uh, I mean, what's so special and important about Harlem? Oh, everything is special about Harlem. First, the music, the culture, the people. And if you really want to get your gear on, this is where you come from. So Harlem, break me a check, because exactly. I'm come on ya. TTC cut the check. I know this, this spot right here, you said it you know, particular to your heart. You said it's your Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Linux right here. Linux? Yeah, Linux Ave. Shout out to Bill Bell. I see the black right there. A little further up, you already know. Okay. Take you to the upper, upper, a little farther up, the upper, upper, upper Lennox place. What you get from the upper, upper? What you get from over there? Um, use your imagination. <laughs> Take a wild guess. I don't know. Now you want me to show you all the secrets? Yeah, you gotta get into the secret. You better stay tuned then and pay attention. Exactly. We gonna sit back. We gonna relax. We gonna really get into Lady K. Yeah. Let's look at her name. How about that? Nah, no, let me take you to this other place. I don't know. Really? That you know too. Are you, you gonna look out for me? Cause I'm hungry. <laughs> I ain't eat all day cause I knew I was coming up the hall and I knew he was gonna put me on so I need to So hold on, first we're gonna do the interview and then I'm gonna feed him. Thank you very much. Lean right here and eat. <laughs> Let's all take right. a walk. Let's go that way. Alright, okay. So me, I'm, I'm, I'm familiar about Harlem. You know, like, he don't know oh, shit about Harlem. Oh, See, you said I don't know See, shit. That's Harlem that's right there. Harlem. <laughs> that's Harlem right there. I said I'm familiar. You said, nigga, you don't know shit. <laughs> you don't live with me, motherfucker. <laughs> That's the type of shit I'm glad you say that to me. You would have seen that cat fight. You see? <laughs> so when you think of Harlem and in regards to music, like what, what do you think about? Like who's like some of the first MCs that come to your mind? Well, Harlem definitely to me was um, Cameron. Okay. You know, Cameron definitely represents yeah. Harlem. And right now, you know, I got to say, Max B really took the whole Harlem to the whole yeah. top of the world. Believe that. And uh, you know, the dead. You know. Yeah. Definitely. Big L, he Big used to call L me gangster. He used to call me studio gangster. Really? Why was that? I don't know, because I was always too gangster in the studio. <laughs> oh, this is how you gotta do it. <laughs> but um, Big L, who else? Who else from Harlem? Um, there's a lot of flavor over here in Harlem. Shout way. out to BMG. You know, shout out to Henny the Don coming up. You know, okay. those are upcoming artists. Okay. Um, and the dance. You know, DJ Webstar. You know, you know who's at the Harlem Shake? Shake and the other, I can't even <laughs> do it. I'm embarrassed what, myself. What Everybody go yell at me. That's somebody to do it for us. <laughs> yeah. right you gotta find a little eight year old. They be getting it in. They be getting it in. Yeah, eight to ten. Let's see. Well, anyway. It's crazy, because I know that, um, Miss Tavia Momo, are you the originator? Of the group? Are you the founder of the group? Because I know that. Oh, what group? Uh, Dipset? Dipset? No, I know you got your own group that you deal with as well from back in the day, right? Oh, Murder Mommy. Exactly. Well, uh, yeah, I'm the I'm founder. You can say go. I started that whole movement. Actually, I am the Murder Mommy. There you go. That's what it is. Wipe that's, it off. that's what the Murder Fuck Mommy it. said. I am the, the murder, murder mommy. mommy. Yes, sir. <laughs> so That's what I was a lot about. of female got influenced for everything that I do and to, wanted to be a part of it. Mm -hmm. and, and basically, it was a buzz that, just, that started creating for women to try to get along together and That's grow together. And eh, that was the wrong thing to do <laughs> because we didn't get along. We didn't agree with nothing. But anyway, big shout out to Remy Ma. Shout you out to know, Remy. She was Remy. part of the murder mommies, and you know she you know, made bad decisions with her future. Mm -hmm. But, you know, that doesn't really have nothing to do with the movement. The movement was more like music. We bad women in the music, so exactly. that, that make us kind of like killing the game. You know exactly. what I'm saying? You know? So that's what we got at Murder Mommy. Park. So I got a quick question then. It, when, when people break up, is it more so over money or is it more so over personal relationships? Over money, so you know. Money. Once a group start making money, whoever's ahead of the group always want to take all the money, and everybody else working hard they want some of that money, <laughs> and then they feel like if they part of the group, they can get their own money. Exactly. So you know, so that's how it always end up being. Though. That's what it is. So who, who got the most money out of the murder mobs? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> they want it. <laughs> you know why? They want it. They Cause want I it. work. You know why? Cause I be sitting on my butt all day doing nothing. Nah, uh -huh. let me stop. Nah. Now nah, I don't know. Big ups to everybody out there. All, all day. All day. You know, all day. they got their own money too. Of course, of course. I mean, it takes a while Thanks to Thanks to who? <laughs> <laughs>
I bet it. We gotta keep the peace. I love you, murder that. mommy. So it was a murder mommy out there. I love you, baby. Oh, keep so, going. So how, how would you decide who would actually be inducted into a murder mommy? Like, did they have to go through a little sorority oh, type thing? Oh, nah, 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 nah. Right now, actually, it's not even going down like that. Right now, it's just, you know, something that I created. Actually, I left that alone about three years ago. Okay. Because, you know, I felt like I have to reorganize that picture right there. And I didn't feel like... Like I was ready, so I had to really grow Lazy K, and I came with Lazy K Productions LLC, which is that's my company. And the same way I broke murder, murder mommies, it's a company that break artists. Okay. You know, I look for talent, I develop the talent, then I promote the talent, then I try to get the talent signed, you know, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And, and that's what Lazy K Productions do. I also have a lot of DJs who promote all the Lazy K Production music, different producers, and definitely, you know, international, as always. As always. That's why it's more flavor TV. It's international, yeah. baby. Overseas. I got Murder Mommies in Belgium. I got DJs in Belgium. Woo. Lazy K Production Woo. DJs in Europe, in France, in England. <laughs> so, yeah, that's radio loud as fuck. Supplies last. This is a store. That's smart.com. 808. Bang it on the block. <laughs> I ain't mad at that shit. That shit loud as hell. You can't be laughing is. like that. So I got a question. Um, run down the, 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 the list of people that is under, you know, Lazy K LLC. Oh, well, actually right now. So who, who are you see. promoting? Who, who's first up the bat? Who's next Well, up? I have um definitely first SK. Okay. He's from Brooklyn. He's an upcoming rapper. He's sick SK. with it. And his whole organization, his whole group is called Piff Stars. Oh, okay, Piff Stars. I don't know why All they right. call it Piff Stars, right. but that's who they are. Piff Stars. Stars and then the Piff. I have Sky High LLC. It's another group. Okay, really? You <laughs> yeah. like putting them groups together, yeah. don't you? That's what it is. That's what it is. And they're from actually Irvington, New Jersey. It's oh. a small town. Right. This real, real gangster, real ghetto in Jersey. Not okay. to say it any other way, but you know they kind of run that city over there, and you know they move units. They on the ground. They like to sell CDs and they like to be exposed. So I was like, you know, you can be part of Lazy Gate Productions. Right. And then I have the DJs. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all my Rhode Island DJs. Shout out to Echo. Okay. Shout out to DJ Deco. Deco. He's also Lazy K Productions. And then, you know, I got a lot of more coming, but I don't have the names yet because that's the two that I'm main promoting right now. Okay. And um, yeah. I have to tell you, too, of course, I work, you know, not work, but run a, a, a program, a DJ program for kids at the Boys and Girls Club in North. That's big. So I teach kids from 10 to 13, 14, 15 how to DJ, and they think they're better than me already, but <laughs> hold on, I'm your teacher, so you have to slow down. No, that's what it is. That's what it is. You, yeah. I know, now, see, I used to teach back in the day. You always got that one kid in the class. Yeah, they know the everything. They the star. I mean, who's yeah. that star pupil right now? You, you know somebody's going to be the next yeah, DJ. Yeah. Okay. Shout what, out to my they? young DJs. You already know. Shout out to DJ Kool Aid. Shout okay. out to Money Mouth. Shout wow. out to Big Business. Shout out to DJ Ears. Love shout yourself out to, right now. Shout out to DJ Sugar High. Shout out to, those are my little kids. That's what's up. That's my upcoming oh, DJ. Yeah. Is it cool? Yeah. Wow. In order, in order cool to brunch, be in order, boys and Boys and girls club in North. That's what's up. But in order to be in my class, you gotta create your own DJ name. So and then in my party, one or two DJ and the rest of the class be dancing. So you can imagine my class That's is hot. hot. You ever thought about maybe doing like the, the, the little kids DJ and have the like little kid party and the whole situation? Oh yeah, we're doing that already. This Friday is the end of the school. So That's you know. Right. Are we gonna check it? I just want to watch. See the little kids oh, yeah, doing the do Harlem it. Shake, that little kid DJ. That no, cool. they actually they don't do the Harlem shit. They do the booty bounce. Wow. Oh, booty and it's bounce. like kind of like a little club music mix, mix with um, mix with um, I'm not gonna say it's club kind of with loops of hip hop and they just go fast and they boom 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 and the girls be like shaking the little booty when they do it. <laughs> but we gonna save that kids, for another DVD. Oh yeah, watch oh, your kids because they know how, they know what to do. Like <laughs>